we are trying to figure out the value of 2xy. And if you look at your answer selections, all the answers only have A and B in them, no X or Y. So let's take these two equations, two, X plus Y equal A and X minus Y equal B. And I'm going to solve them, solve it for X and Y. And I'm using the process of elimination. Elimination means you add the two equations together and you eliminate a variable. So if you add an X plus an X, you get two X and then positive y minus y, that cancels out, it's eliminated, and then add the right-hand side, you get a plus b. Well, I'm gonna leave this like this, 2x equal a plus b, because I can substitute in a plus b for that 2x. So in this first part, I was trying to get rid of my y's. Now in this second part, I'm going to get rid of my x's, and that way I can solve for y. Well, if I add these two equations together, my x's are not eliminated. So what I'm going to do is multiply the top equation, both sides, by negative 1. And if I do that, I get negative x minus y equals a negative a. And then write down the second equation. And you see now when you add your equations together, your x's cancel out. Now add the negative y minus y, that's a negative 2y, equals, add the left-hand side together, and that gives you a b minus an a. Now, I think what I want to do is, let's get rid of, let's multiply the thing on both sides by negative 1. So I have a positive coefficient. So it's 2y equals a minus b. I multiply the negative 1 times the negative a and negative 1 times the b. So solve for y. y equals a minus b divided by 2. Now remember, we're trying to find 2xy. Well, we know what 2x is. 2x is a plus b. And then we want to multiply that by y. And we just found y to be a minus b over 2. But if you look at your answers, you do not see that one. So this is a plus b over 1. Well, let me write it like this. a plus b times a minus b. 1 times 2 is 2. Square out, or foil out, the numerator. a times a is a squared. a times negative b is a negative ab. b times a is a positive ab. I got that by multiplying here. And then b times negative b is a negative b squared, all over 2. And those cancel, so you're left with a squared minus b squared over 2, and that's one of your selections.